Alright guys, how's it going? So every now and again, you come across an add-on that you think, this is damn good. And this is one of these add-ons. And I highly recommend it, straight off the bat. It's available for free, I'll put the link in the description down below. And it's called Create Primitive Add-on. Now just to give you a quick example, if I come up to Add, go to Mesh, I have my own primitives. And this is a background. And this is one of these add-ons that is a production tool. Now, I could easily add in a mesh, do a plane, tab into edit mode, do a quick extrusion on an edge, do a quick bevel, add in some segments, and I have my background. And I can also save this as a file and easily import it at a later date. But I actually want this as a primitive. So what I'm going to do here is, I'm actually going to select this edge and I'm going to extrude it out like this. I'll jump back into object mode. I'll come to my properties tab and you can see here, create prim. And I'm actually going to assign it a name, so I'll call it my light studio, just for an example. Now if you hit apply transformation, that essentially applies the transformation. And these objects are actually stored with modifiers as well, so you can actually add in a modifier. And I'm going to hit create primitive. Now essentially what this does is, it writes its own Python file, which means it could be shared with other users, and it gets stored to the app data folder. Now if I come to add, go to mesh, you can see here, my light studio, so I'll just quickly delete this object just to prove a point, add, mesh, my light studio, and you get to build your own primitives. And this is why I highly recommend this add-on. Do me a favour guys, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter, I've got a couple of mates now, you know what to do, peace.